Hey you guys, me and myself here. Welcome back to Phobia Saturday. Today we are going to talk about the fear of computers, the fear of damp, moist places, and like always, I forget the third one. Let's see what it is. The fear of nosebleeds. Alright, to start this off, we're going to start talking about the fear of computers. <laughs> uh, Logazome combophobia. I cannot say that word. It's impossible. Uh, phobia is the fear of computers. Computers. The origin of the word log is Greek, meaning talk a word. Mankano is Greek, meaning machine. And phobia is Greek, meaning fear, like always. It is considered a specific phobia and is also related to cyberphobia, which is the fear of working on computers and technophobia which is the fear of technology causes traumatic heretic I'm not quite sure which one this would more or less be uh, I couldn't tell you but um, symptoms dry mouth nausea you probably don't want to go on computers get on computers play video games on computers any of this stuff to do with computers like me recording audio with the computer and mic probably you wouldn't be doing that and yes, medicine can be prescribed. I think that's everything. Oh, yeah, I do one of those systems. So, hygonophobia is the fear of liquids, dampness, or moisture. 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 People with this phobia tend to fear liquids of any form. The origin of the word hygro is Greek meaning moisture and you know what phobia is Greek for and it is considered a specific phobia. Causes dry mouth, nausea, anxiety, all that fun stuff. You probably won't drink water. I'm not sure. You would have to drink water to live but I'm pretty sure you don't want to. You probably don't drink any sodas. You probably only drink water when you have to. Stuff like that. Um, um, causes traumatic heretic I have no idea probably more of traumatic because if like say you keep getting dunked underwater when you're a kid you're gonna develop a fear of being dunked and of water because you're being dunked in water etc <coughs> <coughs> um, yes medicine can be prescribed last one epixinoxophobia which is the fear of nosebleeds. Mmm, nosebleeds. Yes. Alright. I'm gonna read this straight off the page because of how long it is. So, give me a minute. Anexinophobia is the fear of having or seeing nosebleeds or bleeding to death. Dang. The origin of the word Greek, empi, means above or on, upon. Satix is the escape of blood from the vessels or bleeding, and phobia means, you know. It is considered to be a specific phobia, and it is also related to hemophobia, hemonophobia, hemonophobia, which is all the fear of blood or transfusion. Uh, <coughs> <coughs> Alright. Causes uh, traumatic or heretic, probably more traumatic. Because if, like, you get a big cut, you're going to be like, ah! uh, Not necessarily on the wrist, legs, knees, face. <laughs> uh, anyway, you're probably going to be like, oh, no. I'm going to bleed to death, and you're going to develop that fear. Or if you get, like, really bla bad bloody noses, like, I used to get bloody noses that would last a half an hour, half an hour at times. And it would suck, really suck. Symptoms, dry mouth, nausea, all that fun stuff. And yes, medicine can be prescribed. Alright, that's the end of the phobias. It's time for announcements. Um, 29 subscribers still working towards 30. It's going to be amazing when we hit 30. I'm going to thank you guys so much. Because it will mean a lot to me. And what over 2,000 videos we views. Which also means a lot to me. And I hope you guys are happy with my content. If there's anything I can do to improve it. Please let me know. I'm always open for improving. And making it better. Uh, I think that's all I got. Oh yeah. Next week is Halloween, and there's actually going to be a special video out for it, Five Nights at Freddy, if you don't know. 
you can get updates about it on um, Twitter, so go follow me at me and myself, M-E-A-N-D-M-Y-S-A-L-F. I tried to get me and myself, but somebody else already take it. But for Halloween, I'm being the Joker, so I have this thing. It's a jacket, and then on the front of it, it has his vest, and because I'm too lazy to freaking put on makeup. <laughs> Uh, but that wraps up this episode of Phobia Friday. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Please leave a like. Hit that subscribe button if you'd like more from me. And I'm me and myself, and I'm signing out. I'll see you guys next time.